Hi, my name is Claire, and I'm just trying this out. And I like reading books, and I know how painful it is to um, not have books to read. <laughs> so I'm here to suggest I have four books just to see how this goes. I don't even know if I'm going to upload this video, but if I do, then random talking. Okay, but the first book is The Perks of Being a Wallflower. This book is really good, and I love it, and it's sad, but happy and funny. I don't know. You should all read it. I'm not really good at this. <laughs> I don't know. It's just really good. And it's one of my favorite books. And it fits in your pocket if you get this one. It fits in my um, sweater pocket. It's easy transportation right there. Okay, the next one people might know about because it was recently turned into a movie. It's called If I Stay. This one, you need um, tissues. You're, you're going to need a lot of tissues and a lot of ice cream and or whatever your comfort food is, maybe maybe your family members, because this one is really heartbreaking and sad, but it's beautiful, and there's a sequel, and I didn't know there was a sequel for like two years, <laughs> so I was like, you can't just end a book like that and not have there be a sequel, and then I was in the store, and I was like, oh mom, can I buy if I stay, and then I was like, oh, what's where she went, it has like the same girl on the cover, and then I was like, oh my god, it's a sequel, and I was like, there's a sequel. <laughs> It, it shocked me and it was a very happy day, but then I read it and I was really sad. <laughs> but these are really good books. The next one, Mind the Nakedness of My Book. It's called The Murder Complex by Lindsay Cummings, just because there's no cover. Um, I don't like covers on hard cover books because they always slip off. That's why I don't get books from the library because you can't take the cover off. But this book is really, really good and I want it to be really popular so there's a chance of a movie because that would be amazing and I don't care if they like completely ruin it I just want to see it as a movie I don't know <laughs> it's really good it's like futuristic hunger games -y. really good book I love it and the author she follows me on Twitter and she's actually really nice she'll yeah I don't know she's really nice and I really love the book and I'm rereading it and I just I love the guy's name his name is Zephyr like who doesn't want a guy named Zephyr in a book I don't know. <laughs> the next one is actually a how to write a book book. Just, it has a fictional storyline so it's not boring, if that makes sense. It's called Polly Wants to Be a Writer and it has a dragon and a little girl and the dragon's eating her computer. And this book, because I want to be an author, and this book helps me because it talks about how long like a book would be. I guess, like how long it would be to be in novel territory, which is like six, wait, <laughs> I remember this, um, it was, I bookmarked the page, um, I'm pretty sure, 45 words, I mean 45,000 is novel territory, like that and higher, which is actually like not that hard to get if you really, really try. I've already finished a book, and thanks to this one, I knew how much, how many words I had to get to. But yeah, it's really good, and it's it's funny in some parts, and it's it just helps you write a book, like, and it's not boring. Okay, yeah, I need to finish reading that one. I've gotten distracted with other books, but it's good. It's it's good. I hope that this was an okay video. Yay, it's my first video in case you haven't noticed. So I'm sorry for the awkwardness that is radiating off my body. And my hand motions, I just... I do hand motions, sorry. But yeah, I hope that this isn't the last video. And I hope it is the first. Bye. <laughs>